Someone asked me what I do about horses that are head shy. Um, so I'll just show you real quick what I'll do. So if you notice when I go to touch his ears, he lifts his head up and moves his face away. So what I'd like to do is find a starting point. So let's say right here on his face, if he's happy with me touching him right here, see how he's not scared there. Um, what I'll do is I'll find that starting place and find a finishing place. So find out where he's, to see if I touch him up by his ear, he's not happy, but he's fine with me touching him here. So what I like to do is start here and very quickly run my hand over his ear. And it happens too fast for him to notice what happened. And now I'm just petting him on the neck. So I go from petting him on the nose to petting him on the neck and just brush over his ear. And before you know it, he'll kind of not even realize that you touched him on the ear. So you see there, I touched him on his ear, but it was too quick for him to notice. So just continuing that theory brushing over his ear, starting here where he's comfortable, brushing over his ear onto his neck, starting on his face here again, brushing over his ear onto his neck. And if you leave your hand on his ear for too long, he'll, he'll catch on to what you're doing. But pretty, see how he's already, <laughs> he's already relaxing with it? Instead of just going straight for his ear, you start here or find a spot where they like you touching them, brush over the ear onto the neck. Okay, and it, it just, depends how consistent you are but you'll you can really quickly fix that problem of them being head shy and ear shy and now i've got a hold of his ear and he's totally fine with it so that's something you can try with a head shy horse